Hey, what's going on guys? Wildfox Lawn Service here. Back in another video, and today guys, we got a huge landscape tear out we're gonna be doing. So you got a lot of those accent shrubs, or trees I guess, called Dwarf Alberta Spruces. I'll be cutting those out. They want them cut out with the chainsaw to save a little bit of money, rather than pull them out. Plus, some of them are pretty close to the foundation of the house. And I'll also be digging out multiple other bushes, and then generally just cleaning the gardens and prepping them, because I'll be installing landscape rock in the future, guys. So I'll be prepping the beds for that, so stay tuned for a future video on that. Also guys, I'll be showing you a new piece of equipment I bought as well as a sneak peek at the trailer that I just put wood sides on. Alright guys, I'm not going to hold you up with that, let's get right to it.
All right, guys, so we just finished up just about all that, and now I'm actually gonna go back with the blower and clean it up, and I don't think I've shown you guys it yet, but I actually made a new purchase. I got a new blower, here's what it is. So I'm gonna clean it up with the blow real quick. You guys get a little bit of footage with the new machine and then I'll show you guys the finished product. All right, guys, now that that's all done, I guess I can show you the finished product. So here's how the front came out. There's one of the dwarf Alberta spruces here, a thorn, thorny bush here, and that was full of leaves. Right here was another dwarf Alberta spruce, and then right here actually was an arborvita that went all the way up, and it was stuck up there uh, on the gutter. Now, I didn't show taking that down because I actually needed the client's help to do that. We roped it up and pulled it away from the gutter up there, and then I was able to cut it down. Another dwarf Alberta spruce was here and here. I also cut up, there was a whole bunch of excess growth on the tree right here on the base of it, and I cut all that off as well. Another spruce was here, as well as down there, and I raked up all this stuff here. Now keep in mind guys, I'm just raking this stuff up like this. Uh, I'm gonna end up putting rock down, landscape rock down in the future. Possibly make a video on that, we'll see. There was another little Alberta spruce here. A couple plants I had to dig up over here, there's about three of them I believe. And then right here, uh, growing up, I'm not sure what kind of bush that was, uh, but I ended up cutting that out and it had like three or four little bases right there I had to cut out. And then last guys, we have all the way along here, there was one, two, three, four of those spruces, I believe. And then I had to dig up a holly, uh, three little thorny plants, and something else that I can't quite remember at the moment. But here's how that looks now, all cleaned up and ready for landscape rock. Alright guys, so to finish up this video, we actually got a piece of fan mail to open up here from KC Law Enforcement down in Missouri, I believe it is. Uh, so without further ado, let's see what's in here. So we got a quick note here, it says, have a great year! And now we also sent out this KC Law Enforcement Super Sweet Decal, which is going to be going up in a man cave right now. Super awesome of you sending it out, man. Really appreciate it. If you guys haven't already, be sure to go to Instagram down below and, try and follow Casey Law Enforcement. Super duper awesome for them to send it out and what a great way to finish off the video. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed today's video. As always, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.